Gary, what was the reason why you came here in the first place? Uh, mainly with anxiety, with shaking, and no power in my left side. Okay. What had caused that? Uh, unsure. Probably injuries through sport, uh, dislocating ribs, uh, collarbones. What sport did you play? What was your main sport? Uh, I was in triathlon. Okay. So. Okay, so what happened? You started to lose power down your left side? What yeah, happened? I had no energy in my left side. And I was talking to uh, Pete Dorries, and he recommended that I come here and see if we could sort it out. Which, How long ago was that? Uh, that was back in April, and it's now July, and things have come back to normal. Okay. Just when you first walked in, what was your understanding of what was going to happen in this therapy centre? Well, I had no idea. So it was only a couple of documentaries I watched, and I thought, I've got to go and try, and hence, that's why I've been here every day. Okay, just trying to explain, when you were training, when you were debilitated, how much power did you have down the left side, perhaps? Not a lot at all. On the bike, it was just the right side was doing the driving, and the left side was going for the ride. And this is your passion, of course, but that would have made that passion quite... Quite difficult, you could say. Well, it did. It cut it down from about 500 k's a week to around about 80, 90 k's. Wow, OK. So this is pretty severe because you obviously like doing that yeah, sort of pursuit. Cycling, yeah, 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 cycling was one of the main things. And uh, along with triathlon, which I quit probably five years ago mm -hmm. uh, because of injuries and um, just kept running and cycling and mm -hmm. a bit of swimming. And OK, so when you came in, um, just take us through the process. What happened and what, what's, what's um, rejuvenated and regenerated your body? Well, it's basically teaching me to keep a balance and a flow in the body. In other words, we're not using heavy weights. It's all on lighter weight. Mm -hmm. And keeping it controlled, it's um, the best form of training I've ever been. Really? Yep. Mm. And I've been to a lot of gyms. As you say, it's not, it's not full on, isn't it? It's, 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 it's light weights and it's, it's just a program to help the body... Yeah, well, it's just light weights and... I had to get that through my head to start with. What are we doing? But when it's all explained to you, it now makes a lot of sense. Okay. How? In what way? That's, well, that's the difficult part. Isn't well, it? basically, it makes a lot of sense in slowing down and just controlling everything you do. So it's all in a flow motion. Uh, it's not in aggressive motions, which we've been taught in the past. It's the whole body approach. And once you get everything balanced up, and as it was proven on the treadmill, and with uh, computer graphics and everything else, uh, I'm within 95% of where I should be. Wow, that's pretty cool, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Yep. And could you feel how quickly was the process, you know, oh, re-engagement of the left side? Yeah, the process was near enough instant within the first uh, week. You could feel the difference. Because it's fair to say you were surprised? I was very surprised. So, and, and, and I'm pretty pleased. <laughs> and I was, I was real pleased because it's, it's given me something to aim for. It, it lets me get back out and do what I wanted it. Mm. So, and over a period of three weeks, we're, we're back within, as I say, 95% of where it should be. Well, what other met methods of therapy were you pursuing to try and Oh, I'd it? been chiropractic. Uh, basically, that's where I'd been with mm -hmm. a chiropractor for many years. Mm -hmm. And Can you, were you getting worse or was it getting worse or was it stabilising well, or were you just, this before you came in? Yeah, basically, it, it wasn't improving. Mm -hmm. And especially with the shaking and everything else. And now that's both, you know, that's probably two thirds gone. Okay. So. But the program you do, just run through what you do when you do come in, because obviously you've done the, the, the course. Yep. You, you had the, what, the four day course, but now you're doing a program afterwards. Yep. Just explain what you do on a normal given day. Well, on a normal day you do, um, mm -hmm. probably one day you'll do legs and the next day it's uh, upper body. Mm -hmm. um, and then it's a bit of a mixture. So it's anything from shoulders to legs to yeah, just keep it all going. This might be a funny question, but how old do you feel as opposed to how old you are? What do you can you, you know, what do you uh, feel at the moment? How strong ba you basically, are? I don't I don't feel as old as what I am, mm. and I can still keep up with most of the younger ones. So how young? <laughs> how young are they? Oh, most of them, you know, around their thirties, forties. Uh, you know, you've got along with them. I can go with them. So, are they surprised to see you up there alongside? Oh, some of them are. <laughs> And how long are the rides that you're doing? How long? Are oh, the basically the rides I'm doing at the moment is between 50 and 80 k's. So that's a fair day outing. Yeah, that's a that's a little outing. And the thought of doing this, which you're doing regularly now, just a couple of months ago, that wasn't no, on that your radar. No, that wasn't on my radar. It was back around the 20, 30 k's, you know, for a ride.
And only on one side working? And one side working. But now, with, after a week here, I was out doing an 80k ride. Mm. So I did a 10k ride on the Saturday and an 80k ride on the Sunday. So that was after week one. Yeah. Clear thinking, not, not slouching about anymore. It's the body's more alive. And yeah. And just one more thing, after you do those 80k rides, the rehab after that, are you bouncing back quick, yeah, quickly I'm than I'm, where yeah, you would have been uh, in the previous? I'm bouncing back, I'm in the coffee shop and off and going again. Uh, some of your mates must be thinking, what drug are you on, is that fair to say? Yeah, well that's about zero. <laughs> <laughs> so no drugs anymore? No, we, we, any, any drug I take is a blood pressure tablet. Right, right. So that's it. But you, when your friends ask you what's happened, because they would have seen you slowly yeah. getting you know, a bit yeah. worse, what are they, what, how are you explaining to them? You're obviously Well, I'm, them I'm telling them where I've been, I've been to, I've been to neuro, neurophysics and well, what's that, how does that work? Mm. And I'm saying, well the easiest way is to hop on their website and have a look at the documentaries and talk you, to them. You, look, you literally are the proof in the pudding, aren't you? Well, I'm the proof of the pudding, so I'm up and about. And you've got a smile on your face yeah. and you're doing pretty well with yourself. <laughs> and I'm going. Right. But you're really happy you turned up here. Yeah, I'm happy I turned up here. This has changed This has changed everything. You know, like, I now have got a purpose and I know I can come here and I get all the help I need.